What's going on YouTube? Marina X back at it again. And listen, we got to talk about one of my most favorite EDCs as of recent times, which has been this copper monster of an EDC kit. Now, I know all sorts of folks like to do special EDC type of crap. And I'm one of them, man. I decided to kind of put together an EDC kit specifically for the Halloween season. So check out my EDC Copper Kit for 2022. So the first thing we got to talk about, man, is the EDC knife. This here is the Kershaw Leak. This thing comes in the copper colorway. This thing is awesome. I love the way this thing works it works freaking well super small compact it's already starting to develop a lot of patina which is nothing wrong with that whatsoever now this knife is going to be a really good knife if you're going to be using simple tasks if you're an amazon box warrior or some crap like that this might be something that you consider freaking grabbing for yourself the blade on this thing is a cpm 1164 what does that mean this is just a couple steps above budget but it's not totally just some trash blade that you're gonna pick up. You know, it may not keep its hardness as good as like a S90V or something like that, probably not even an S30V, but it's gonna be something that's gonna be enjoyable to use and to be able to keep in your pocket. You can even see the patina starting to wear on there. Now, of course, the other thing that you're almost more than guaranteed to have in your pocket with your EDC kit is going to be your freaking wallet. This is the Axwell wallet. This is in their all copper colorway. It's freaking copper on the front and the back. You know, copper is a natural germ killer. This thing is gonna be an antimicrobial properties. Pretty small size. It can hold a ton of wallets with like this friction type opening and closing on the back. Even has a strap in the back if you like to carry physical cash. So I enjoy this thing as well. I'm waiting for this thing to develop the patina, kind of sort of like the, like the knife. Of course, the knife has already started developing more patina than this thing. All right, so let's think about it. You've got your freaking wallet together. You've gotten your freaking knife together. What's gonna be next when it comes into the world of the EDC kit? Well, that's gonna have to do with something that you probably carry with you every day, which is your keys. Now, me specifically, I don't have a bunch of copper keys rolling around, but I do have the Magna by Keybar, which is a pretty cool little tool, super small, but it's just a nice little magnet. Freaking pull here, separate your keys and keeps those so magnetic in nature. I like this thing a lot, man. It makes it easy. I have two sets of keys that I carry primarily. Whenever I have my wife's car key, I want something that's super slim down because she has a key fob. This makes life easier. Also attached to these keys for this super slim EDC kit is the Olight Eye Morse, which is almost called the Eye Mouse, but it's a freaking flashlight. So when I go into places like this, I can come in here if it was night or something like that. I'm on the trail. I can turn this freaking thing on. I mean, it's not pumping out the most lumens, but this is gonna be just enough if I'm gonna walk with my freaking dog. If I'm on my one wheel and I'm going under a bridge or something like that, and I wanna just make sure I have that little bit extra light. I like this thing a lot. It reminds me of their i1RT Pro line. Next on the list has to be something that's with you most of the time, especially if you're into the world of EDC, man cave type of stuff. And that is gonna be your good old freaking lighter. Now specifically, I have the Zippo lighter in the copper, full copper colorway. This is the thing I use. You know, if I'm gonna be going somewhere, if I'm gonna be able to light one of my sticks, or even if I just wanna have it for survival, I like to always have a way to start fire with me. Now this specifically is a Zippo with a butane insert by Vector Thunderbird. Hey, so next thing that I definitely have been incorporating in the EDC kit has been a copper pen. Now this is the Big Idea Designs, the TI Designs mini copper pen. Super freaking nice, super small pint 
nice, all those good descriptor words, writes well. It's already starting to develop some patina, so I really enjoy that little bit look. Twist to use, twist to engage, twist to unengage. All right, so what do you keep in your super specialty niche EDC type of items? Do you have a kit specifically that you like to enjoy? Titanium, brass, copper, green, orange, yellow, whatever the case may be. Let me know by commenting down below. Listen, if you're not a member of the battalion, I would love for you to join the battalion by hitting that subscribe button right below. Also, feel free to join the battalion and join an official company within the battalion. Lots of perks that are down below as well. If this is your first time stopping by, well, appreciate you stopping by. For everyone else, we'll speak soon.